Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. This news in the streets. Join us and tune in for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Hey, tea sippers. Hope you guys are doing good. Just coming through with some more Dragon Ball tea on our favorite couple. It's been a hot mess all day long concerning Krishan Rock and Blueface. So what's going down is this. This morning, Krishan took to social media, and she was basically saying that she was considering aborting her child. And um, she just feels like she's stressed. You know, she's tired of the back and forth with Blueface, and it seems like he doesn't care about her, and she's really, you know, heartbroken about the whole situation. I want you guys to go ahead and check out this video right here. So I got a music video today. Um, I gotta stop throwing up for real. Should I go to the hospital? Like, this ain't safe. Right? Should I need something? Bitch, we better go have fun. You got time to go to the hospital. I should go too with you to get this abortion on. Not real shit. I don't know what to do. I can't be pregnant while this nigga like. I think that's what he's trying to do. Huh? <coughs> no, he's purposely trying to hurt me because what I said on my live when I was like, what did I say? I said he cock blocking and I said he unfair. So he went ballistic. Close to his baby mother that he don't like. So he like, he like, this what you did. You destroyed this. Just like, damn, what the fuck? Just because I don't want to get with your cheating ass shit. It's war now. It's like war. He's trying to shit on me and on the bitch that y'all already shit on. That's why I'm like, damn, I might just, just kill this baby. Oh, no, no. Then he talking about. You got all those tattoos and missing tooth. I'm like, bro, what do y'all got to do with how pretty I am? Nothing. Stop playing with me. All right, so you guys just saw those videos. So once Blueface woke up from performing at his dead-ass concert in Dubai, child, wasn't nobody hyped. He was doing that same dance. Anyways, I guess it must have been a long night for him, but he finally woke up and he started tweeting and going off on Krishan. He feels like once again, she's looking for attention. So the first thing Blueface says is do it, please, meaning he wants her to go and have an abortion. Then he says, I got two kids and one BM for a reason. I don't just have kids with anybody. I'm real particular about the women I have children with. I don't play by my kids and their well-being, nurture, and care. Rock can't even take care of me like a woman should, and I'm a grown man. Imagine a newborn. Then he says, physically fighting on the red carpet, throwing the first punch after announcing a pregnancy, is clearly not mentally fit to put their pride aside for the betterment of their child. That was the first red flag for me. I only like blue fags. It's been a no for me. Then he goes on to say, bitch at the club every night shaking ass pregnant. I promise it's been a no for me. Then he posts a video of Krishan where she was talking about how, how he's cock blocking her from other guys. And he says this, I'm cock blocking a pregnant bitch. Laugh my ass off. Please do it. Pretty please. I'll pay for real. 100K cash and the fees. Then you cock blocking me with fucking with other niggas when you out in the bar. And then Krishan comes back and she says, no, in response to him. Then she says, I'm not even Ray tweet back have fun. That last tweet didn't make any sense. So then after that, it was kind of quiet. Um, you know, this caused a big discussion online. 
as far as like people are really going back and forth on if she should keep this child or she should go through with the pregnancy. And I don't know, it's just kind of disturbing because I'm just thinking to myself, if she goes through with the pregnancy, this baby has to eventually learn what social media is and Google, you know what I'm saying, like their life and their birth. And to know that literally people are having think pieces on if I should be aborted or not before I'm even, you know, here on earth is just crazy. You know, my thing is this, um, I get the people who say that she should have an abortion because it's like, you know, who wants to deal with the headache of having blue face for a baby daddy for the next 18 plus years? But then on the other half, I, I understand to, you know, Kids don't ask to be here. Babies are a blessing, you know, regardless of the circumstance. But I will say this. I get and I can respect Blueface saying that he don't want a whole bunch of kids out here by different women. He's not trying to be Nick Cannon. You know, that's a whole nother trifling ass person. And are coming to E for the mother of all game shows. Having my baby with Nick Cannon. You know, he's not trying to be Nick Cannon. He's not trying to be NBA young boy. He wants to have his kids by one woman, allegedly. He only has two children by the same woman. I can respect that if you're actually trying to do something to prevent pregnancy, okay? Um, we all watch their viral porn tape. Krishan has made it very clear she's not on birth control. She likes it raw. He obviously doesn't believe in condoms, even though he's smashing multiple women and going between... We know for a fact Jaden Alexis and Krishan. In that porn tape, I didn't see Nan condom. So for somebody who's very adamant about his children being by the same woman and not wanting different baby mamas, it doesn't look like he's doing a whole lot to prevent pregnancy. You know, so that's the part that doesn't make sense to me. We're all grown here. We all know, you know, what it takes to have children. And if you don't want children, then you don't put yourself in a position to become a father to somebody that you don't want to have a child with. When you don't want to have a child with somebody, you stop fucking them. Okay? And especially you stop raw dogging them. Because raw dogging equates eventually somebody's going to get pregnant. And she's been pregnant before. Now she says that she's been pregnant several times. He says it's not true. This was another tweet that he also sent. He says, Rock has only had one abortion by me. I don't know why she keeps saying three, four, five. Y'all remember the first pregnancy stick that she post, right? The line was faint as hell, lying ass. She showed plenty of signs of dishonesty for kicks and giggles. Imagine what she lies about on a bigger scale. Now, I get being wary of her lies, but again, why keep messing with her? Why keep having sex with her? And why keep putting yourself in a situation where she could be a potential baby's mother? If you have all these trust issues and you think that she's off mentally and she's not going to be a fit mother, then why even sleep with this young girl? It doesn't make any sense. Then somebody says to him, they say, stop doing this on social media, bro. She's pregnant. Y'all always get back together because y'all love each other. So just save yourself the embarrassment of all of this for real. Then he replies back, he says, the truth hurts for real. So then after he says that, he goes on to say, this is what Twitter's made for. Then he says, I'm going to get disrespectful till a bitch get respectful every time. Then he says, but, 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 ain't no buts. It's my way or the highway. I'll give a bitch the boot the day of her birthday. I'll let a bitch leave before I ever give leeway. Every time I check the time on Patak Felipe. So after he says that, all of a sudden, Krishan starts tweeting him. And again, this is why I said yesterday, I'm not going to get my emotions wrapped up in this because she's going to go running back to him with that big toothless grin talking about how much she misses him. So this is her recent tweet. Krishan says, no, I'm just being honest. You got to miss me. We literally tweeting back and forth like, hey, daddy, what's up? Besides all that you doing, you must miss me. You literally typing on your phone to communicate to me. At this point, I can't wait to love on you when I see you. Now, if that's not bad enough, she then also says, I only like the beef because it's with my favorite person on my mind. I miss you, daddy. Tongue emoji. So like I said, they are currently lighting her up all over social media. People are over this twisted love triangle. So underneath them comments, people are for real dragging her like, you know what, this is insane. But I told y'all that was going to happen. 
She has some type of Stockholm syndrome to his dick. I don't know what it is. So then he replies back and he says, but I'm the problem, right? I'm telling y'all she's freaked out in the head. And then somebody else says to her, Krishan and Blueface don't text each other. And she says we blocked each other. So they blocked each other on the phone. So they're doing all this publicly on social media. Again, I don't see her leaving him anytime soon. Um, I don't think she's going to have an abortion. Um, he might pressure her and keep asking, but she likes the attention and she wants ties to that man. You know, she figures this is her come up. He's helped, you know, put her on a level that she wouldn't have been able to get on by herself. And at this point, you know, she looks to him for her comfort, her solace, her love. It's really sad. And she comes from a huge family, you know, and she's grown. I get it. But I just wish maybe her mom, her dad, her sisters would just come get her, maybe spend some time back with the family in Baltimore, give her a break from all this nonsense. But the fact that people are arguing if this child should be aborted or not is just sad. And like I said, you know, the sad part is this child has to, has to come into this toxic situation that they didn't ask to be born into. So with that being said, I leave the question up to you all. How do you guys feel about this situation um, with today's episode of Krishan and Blueface, this Dragon Ball T episode of them going back and forth? Feel free to leave a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. Don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to share the video. And last but not least, make sure you're still subscribed to the channel. And I will talk to y'all later. Deuces. If you want the latest news in the streets, join us sentiment for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely T T V show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely T T V show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe.